Hello, I am Vlad Kramer from Soma Laboratory. And today we have presentation of our new project, Terra. So Terra is a polyphonic synthesizer with uh, many conceptual strings, things uh, behind. So, first of all, this is exploration of relationships uh, of a man and a machine. And this kind of machine proposed to you a place where you can get a rest. Feel yourself natural and feel yourself connected with your emotions and your spirit. So behind this very simple uh, organic interface hides, hides complex digital polyphonic synthesizer with uh, microtonal possibilities, with new uh, approaches to many things. For example, keyboard for playing notes, this section. Twelve sensors that are responsible for different kind of movements, for example, strike or slow attack, vibrato, such vibrato. And each sensor you can tune manually, create your own scale. And you can do it even on the flight right during your performance. Then we have pitch modifier here that give you very big range with this simple keyboard. So now I will play just one sensor and modify it pitch using this part. of grand piano in such a small compact design and allows you to play uh, such things such things like uh, uh, arpeggios and melodies and totally new way Then in the left hand you have timbre sounds, sensors that uh, so maybe a little bit not so loud mic, so I hear a lot of feedback from mic. Yes, thank you. And uh, left hand we have timbre sensors that allows you to modify timbre on the fly.
So it uh, designed it as a real instrument. So it's not just a box with knobs, but it's instrument that you can learn how to play and then play with a very big range of different timbres and uh, sound extractions right on uh, your fingertips. So you not, don't need to tweak any knobs. So you have this area for instant playing. This triangle is modification 64 uh, variations of each sound. And uh, the rest is just your uh, instant performance. So this is why one of the reasons why, why so simple interface. Because it's supposed to be that timbres will be played but not adjusted like usually we do, we do right? So we spend uh, big time in studio to create some timbre and then we just play it. So here you play on timbre instantly during the performance.
So you see, this is just one uh, sound, just one engine. So here is, will be 32 different engines, so not presets. So 32 different synthesizers devoted for different sounds. And each engine uh, designed it this way, like you see, so now I just, you see, I, I didn't change present, I didn't tweak a lot of knobs or something like this, but the palette of sound is very big, from smooth to harsh, even noise, uh, basses, everything, and everything on your fingertips. So this is, in my opinion, the most important side of synthesis with, that we use very small, that synthesis is very flexible. And uh, this flexibility of synthesis we must use not only for creating different timbres and then play it like piano, but use it like uh, methods of creation composition. So you can use it like uh, your color palette right inside your performance. And then we can unfold the true power of synthesis, in my opinion. So Terra allows you play uh, sounds that we usually draw in DAW, and, uh, but it can be played in live, for example, like bass. It's not the end. So also the unique feature of this instrument that it's uh, recognize movement of the body and uh, creates different modulations depend on what direction you move it.
This way, we are supposed to let musicians to have new level of freedom of self-expression. So the machine that is instantly ready for performance, very simple, very organic. So interface which perfectly fit your real body. It's not an array of buttons or knobs. It's organized this way that is very comfortable to play, you see. So, positions in one hand and very big uh, palette and range of sounds instantly on your fingertips. So this is uh, designed to be uh, first of all for live performance. When you need to have everything ready to express yourself, express your uh, feelings, emotions right now the minimum of programming, there is nothing to program, and a lot of things to play. So Mid-Terra, this is the very first prototype, it uh, was not finished, so I, now I play just four engines, 
from 32. So a lot of sounds will be farther, different uh, waves of synthesis, etc. And we hope uh, the community will enjoy this synthesizer. So, Vlad Kramer, Soma Laboratories, thank you for your attention.